how are you today? I hope you are well and you have kept safe. Welcome to our mathematics lesson grade 3. And today we are going to learn about division as repeated subtraction. Division as repeated subtraction. I know by now you know what division is. Division is sharing. If you have two things and you are two people, you want to you want to share. Now that's what we are going to do, but today we are going to learn another way of dividing by subtraction. And you know what is subtraction? Is taking away. Are we together? So it is almost the same. When you are dividing, you are subtracting. Are we together? And now we are going to do an example here. We have 12 divided by 3 equals to Dutch. And because we are doing division as repeated subtraction, we are going now to subtract. And when you are subtracting, you take the big number, then you take away the small number. So it is 12, take away 3. So let's take away and don't do it in a rush. Come here and draw 12 balls. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Take away 3. 1, 2, 3. How many are remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So your answer here is 9. And because it is division as repeated subtraction, we are going to repeat until we get to 0. So we take this answer that you have gotten here. 9, take away 3. Equals, so you come here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we are taking away 9. Take away 3. 1, 2, 3. How many are remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You come and write 6. Then you take 6. 6, take away 3. Equals 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You take away 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. So your answer here is... Three. So you come here and take 3, take away 3 equals, so 3 take away 3 is 0. So you come and write 0. So to get your answer, you will count how many times that you have taken away 3 from the numbers that you had. So this is the first time, the second time, the third time the fourth time. So how many times have you taken away three? One, two, three, four. So your answer is four. Let's do another example. Eight divided by two. Always remember we are doing division as repeated subtraction. So we are repeating. So you take eight, take away two. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Take away 2. 1, 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So your answer is 6. So you take 6. 6, take away 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2. How many are remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4. So your answer is 4. You take 4. 4, take away 2. Is equals to 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2. 1, 2. You take 2. 2, take away 2. Equals. 2, take away 2 is zero. So to get your answer, you say that we count how many times that we have 
subtracted. That's why we are saying it is repeated subtraction. One, two, three, four. So how many times have we subtracted? One, two, three, four. So our answer is four. Our answer is four. So when you are doing division as repeated subtraction, you are taking the number that you are dividing and taking away the number of, of uh, the number of people or the number of pupils or the number of children that you have uh, with the objects that you are dividing. Are we together? So now, Lana, I want you to take your books and do this work. And you are going to do it as division, as repeated subtraction. Remember to take the big number and you take away the small number. You subtract from the answer you get until you get to zero. After you do that, you count the number of times that you have that you have subtracted. Are we together? And that's the end of our lesson today. I hope you have enjoyed. Keep safe. Bye-bye.